Hello folks and welcome back to Let's Play Fable 2. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. Last we left off, we had succeeded in helping out the people at Whole Island, making it all nice and sunny. And uh, I decided to go on a small little personal quest of trying to get as many of these boxes as possible. So I went and started doing that. Uh, unfortunately, I had gone... Now it's under clothing. I'd gone and gotten uh, this interesting piece of headgear, a greaser wig. Needless to say, I'm not wearing that. It is literally just a wig. I can take it on and put it off and I'm all blah, 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 blah. So let's trade a pretty necklace for a rebellious if costume. If we could overthrow the chieftain, things would be much better around here. I mean, I could just kill him, but eh. Black wheel get oh I believe that's the outfit worn by members of the Black Wheel Gang. They were a roaming group of necromantic warriors who sang a cappella lullabies during battle. <laughs> what? A cappella a cappella lullabies in the middle of battle. I approve of these guys full ho oh yeah. In, oh, okay. Gang's gang was his most precious possession. Closely followed by hair gel and cough mints. And apparently, I'm more attractive in this thing. Don't, think I've ever seen anyone quite as stylish don't have the puny. Yeah, I thought I bought another puny carrot. This one? No, these crucible peanuts. Which again, I can't get until I hit the crucible. Where goes books? Ow. Well, that's it, I guess. I thought I had more puny carrots, but I guess I did not. I might change the boots I'm wearing, though. Mostly because of that annoying tink, 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 tink noise. But I don't know why. Everyone's fearing me for absolutely no reason. See what I mean? People are just running around and yelling like chickens with their goddamn heads cut off. And making idle threats at me. Uh, oh well. I suppose I should work on another quest. Uh, this time around... I'll work on the summoners. The summoners is a most interesting quest because it is quite, uh, hilarious. If you don't mind listening to dudes ramble on and on and sometimes say funny stuff. That's pretty much fable as a whole when you think about it. It's your fault. You're the one who found it. You're the one who read the words. It's your fault. You're the one who said I was a chicken because I wouldn't read it in the first place. <laughs> yes, but you're the one who. Hey, look. You have to help us. He, he raised, raised the, dead. the dead. Uh, sure. Mother will kill oh, us if she finds you. out. You see, we read aloud from this book we found called the Normanomicon. You're the one who found it, remember? Yeah, and you're the one who read the thing. Oh, is, never mind. We sort of the thing is, accidentally summoned a few hollow men. A few hundred. Ooh. And now they have the book. Only because you dropped it, you big girl. <laughs> you need to clear the graveyard so we can get the book back and put them all back where they came from. Where do you think they came from? Hell, obviously. I don't know. You summoned them. <laughs> uh, Bowerstone Cemetery, two miles. It's not that bad. Not that bad. But yeah. Uh, we're going to now kill up all the hollow men. I think these guys actually are running gag sort of thing in this game anyways. As I've noticed anyhow. Well, I've noticed. Now I just need to kill all the hollow men. That's about it. I wonder if I can dig up the graves. Things you dig up in the graveyards. Oh, hey! Got turned away from the crucifix. Hmm. guy? You please meet so hungry. I am a 
was man, long time ago. Ate meat, lots of meat. Then was demon door, no more meat, only hungry. Please, feed meat now. I mean, I would, pal, but I got a quest to go on right now where I gotta kill a lot of hollow men. How about I come back? I'll, I'll come back in a bit. Oh, dig spot, huh? How ironic that it's on someone's grave spot. Can, can you guys hold on a moment? I'm, I'm a little preoccupied. Oh, no, apparently not. They couldn't wait five whole seconds more for me to go about digging up their buddy's grave. Ah, well. <laughs> uh, Ray's dead. I got that spell. Now, shall we actually dig this up, pup? Yeah. No. 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 Ah. Ah. Stupid freaking! I'm gonna get rid of that ball at some point. There we go. Come on. There. Stupid son of a bitch. I hate that stupid ball. Makes things difficult. But yeah, as you can see, ooh, Highway Manhattan. As you can see, it is actually quite a, quite a powerful weapon that I've, I've come across in that whole thing with the mystery boxes. Hey, I ain't complaining. Easier it is to kill any of these suckers, the better. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? I heard a lot of exploding out of the ground, and I, I insist on things that need the slaying. Hello? Another dig spot? Right now? Okay. I mean, if it's gonna be money, I'm not gonna complain, that's for sure. Yeah! Emeralds. Okay. Emeralds are cool. I like emeralds. They can lead to money-based things. Ooh, I think I can buy this house. I think. Hello? Anyone home? No? Alright. Guess I'll deal with them some other time. I got myself an evil book to find. The Norman and Recurn. If I didn't know any better, I'd say they want me dead. Oh, that's right. I remember what you have to do for this quest now. You actually have to kick the chickens into the guy's mouth. Oh no. Oh no. I'm surrounded. What? Ever shall I do? You can tell I'm I'm really not feeling all that threatened by these guys. Like the only way I'll feel less threatened is if they literally did no damage. You will all die. Um return to death? Go back to being dead. However, you, you'd say that they'd be dead. Ha! Waha! 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 I wonder how this, get, how this weapon's gonna do later game. Ah, uh, yeah. All the XPs. I love it when I gain all the XPs for murdering all these things. Alright, let's try it this way now. Hello. 101 skeletons that I need to murder. I just need to come and mur- Oh yeah, these creepy things. You uh, make emotes at them. And I don't know whether or not they succeed or fail at certain points, but eh. That's a plot door. I can't go through the, that door until the plot says so. Oh. 
Dig spot. I should have called the dog spot. Because he spots all the dig spots. Yeah. yeah. Precious necklace. I could sell that, in theory, I suppose. What's this? Creepy. Uh, nope. I don't want to leave. I just want to finish this quest. All the quest finishings. I might change my pants. I don't know. I know I said that I would change my boots. I think I'll change my boots now, so I'll not be going back on my word. Feet. Popper. Black Wheel Gang boots. I don't remember. Ca oh. Oh, yeah. Wait, did I? <gasps> I got these. Oh, man. Okay, there's the evil, and then there's looking like a right badass. Also, what the hell? I thought I... Yeah, I guess the hand wrap will do. I... I just... You know what? Let's remove the shirt. That's good. Is there any headgear? Just the greaser wig. I don't want to wear the greaser wig. The greaser wig is about the only part of the entire set where I'm like... No. Because, to be fairly honest... I never really understood the greaser wig appeals, as it were. Yeah, well, you would be barring your one great savior. Creepy. Thing moved. Ooh, can I open this? I can. It's a fa It's a one. It's a oneer. Which means I probably should have been here a way earlier. In theory. You guys can see why I haven't really been bothering showing what I get in the silver chests. Because, A, I usually find them when I'm already, like, off camera by quite a bit or something like that. And, B, it's been rather unimpress unimpressive. It's been keys and gemstones and that's about it. Hello, gentlemen. Oh, are you going to continuously spawn? Marvelous. Oh man. I really hope that this weapon proves to be really effective later on in the game, like in the crucible and whatnot. Cause this is this is glorious. This is beautiful. I mean I know that the enemies are going to get harder and whatnot, but eh. Hey. Oh uh, yeah, so much more where that came from. You were such a great hero. Oh, I need to kill 20 more before I can actually access the Normanomicon. That's alright. I love the murdering of these things. I guess it's not really murder. Purifying? It's, it's not really... Because they're already dead. I, I'm not desecrating their dump remains, I mean, they're already desecrated and that they're coming back to life. A oh, thousand gold. Okay, a thousand gold is a little bit more mentionable when it comes to loots. But still, gold's gold. Like, I I make a thousand every, like, five minutes. What is this? Ah, <gasps> treasure. Um... Well, if this is the treasure, it's empty. Where are you barking at, pup? Oh, it's a key. How many of these do I have now? I'm pretty sure that there's... like, I'm, I'm sure I'm reaching some sort of upper echelon of random keys. Thirteen. Okay. Come on, I need to t kill twenty more of you hollow men. Oh yeah, this place looks lovely. Actually, no, I take that back. This place does look pretty lovely. Anyone home? Oh, I can't break down the door. Damn it. 
Where are you barking at? There's nothing around here, dog. Super paranoid of all the undead coming to get you. Ooh. See, if it was something other than these piddly little hollow men that we've been killing in like one shot, I'd understand. Okay, seriously, where's the rest of the hollow men I'm supposed to murder? Hello? Hollow men's. Alright. Is this a door? Or uh, nope. Or at least it's not one that I can open right now. Hmm. And you said you'd come back to haunt me. Huh. Shows how much you know. Well, I mean, if one of these hollow men ended up being the person coming back to haunting you, then I'd I'd say that that about fits the bill. Maybe it's over here? I'm kind of surprised that there's no, not that many more dig spots. Okay, what is his face? This looks like an angry sneer face. Do I have an angry sneer face? That's Luke the Traveler. I wanted to target this thing. Uh... Yeah, I don't know. Go away, Luke. I don't want to deal with you. What's up, guy? Excuse me. I... I... Okay. Okay. Now, this one is point and laugh. Oh, you'd think they'd get us better boot. Walking the beat isn't easy in these stiff things. Uh, you are one of my least favorite citizens, so watch it. I never know whether or not what the hell these things do. Mostly because every single time I come here, I'm like, oh, hey, I gotta focus on killing the hollow men, and then I go about trying out these things, and they do that, and then I'm like, what? Come on, where are they? There's 20 more. Where are these 20? This is the way out, isn't it? Or at least this is the way I came. There's all the chickens I'll need to kick into the guy's mouth. Unless they're further up here? Across here. Around here, somewhere. It'd be nice to break the monotony a little bit more with the dog trying to find more things. Just saying. Maybe I'll have to go back to the Norman Omicron and do something about it. Maybe attack it a few times. A few billion times or something. I don't know. We shall see. I'm going a little bit mad with all of these freaking gravestones and nothing else to really show for it. I don't think I have this emotion. Looks like anger. Grr. Arr. Arr. Sort of emotion. I don't think I have that one. Alright, here's the Normanomicon. With which I can do... nothing. Okay. Right, the plot line is leading us out here now. Do I... what do I do? Where are you leading me? Where are we going, plotline? Oh, I hadn't been this way yet, have I? Nope, I hadn't been this way yet. <laughs> ah, sweet, sweet XP. Feed me XP! Well. That was, uh, rather simple. I guess it's a little bit easy when you have a huge knocking, well, a huge number of damage on your sword. What is this? I don't know what it is, but apparently there's treasure. Ooh. 
That's 14 silver keys. Uh, big spot. Let there be something good. Also, it's kind of creepy the way that everything's just kind of set up back here and, um... Yeah, that's about it. There's just barrels and... And abandoned crates and... That's about it. I mean, unless there's more people to kill around here. Oh wait, is that a door open? Door I can open, rather. Open. Knock, knock. Nope. Okay. I better go collect the Normanomicon. Because I don't want that falling into anyone else's stupid, stupid Albion hands. Albonian? I don't know. I don't know. Albanian? No. That's not it. What is what are these folk called? Albionians? Albalonians? I don't know. Collect book. Leave place. It's about all I can think of right now. Or grab book. Give book to Sam. Wait, why am I giving the book back to those idiots? I, I don't trust those guys with this book. They already went and summoned like a hundred hollow men accidentally. What else are they going to do? And yes, this entire quest line, well, quest itself anyways, is a giant nod to the Army of Darkness. I mean, Normanomicon, Necronomicon, and this uh, part that's coming up in just a hot second. It is all very, very reminiscent of the whole idea of Aria Darkness. Evil Dead. Ash Campbell. These guys. I got your book. Oh. Oh. Now read from the book. I dare you. Right. What page was the undo spell on? Uh... Oh, here we are. Tantir Barada Kanda. Mukluk. What? You have better not have just done something far, far worse. But now I can go around showing a hollow head to people and getting renowned that way. Yeah. But uh, before I go about doing that, I'm going to run back into the cemetery and see about what the hell that um, one demon door has behind it. Because I have plum forgotten. I have plum forgotten, not grape forgotten. Alright. Just need to line up the shot and... Boop. Nope. Wrong one. Oh, there you are, guy. How's that chicken? Nope, uh, that was a miss. How close do I need to be for these chickens to actually get into his face hole? Face hole! F face hole! No, not that way, you bolt. I think that chicken's gone and into oblivion now. Well, I think the chicken's gone. go and respawn, though. So I'll just need a hot second. Maybe a bit of a wind-up. I now can get the Chicken Chaser title. Meat good? Yes. Alright, come on. Just gotta kick this guy. A little bit closer. You go inside now. Oh, only the one chicken? Okay. I mean, I'd be satisfied with, like, three to five chickens, but, you know, if you just wanted the one chicken, that's that's fine for me. I like rewards. 
Oh, this is a rather lovely place. Really nice. And there's this. Looks like, uh... Looks like di- oh. I s really? Now, you would think behind these demon doors there's gonna be more awesome treasure, right? Or a Balverine strength potion. That works. Skill potion. Infused will potion. That's a whole lot of experience I probably could have used like a couple of hours or videos ago. Not that I'm complaining, it's um... Wallace, it's not that hard for me to gain experience. Seeing as I can literally just buy all the potions from the alchemist shop, then it's nice to get a couple of free ones every so often. <sighs> well, I guess that's it for the creepy quest that this one was. Ooh, spooky. Oh man. I look like a right badass. I just do. Alright. Uh, when we return, I suppose I shall have probably gotten the rest of the items to open up the rest of those mystery boxes back in Knothole. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Cheers.